Washington. Hey, we're very fortunate to be here with Jake Way. We're here over off of Melrose, and just behind Jake, oh my gosh, there's a red carpet, and who have we had over here? You actually had Kelly Osborne right behind you. Absolutely. And Sharon Osborne. Talk about exciting. Boy, you are living the life here in Hollywood, aren't you, Jake? Oh, absolutely. I love it. Great town. But this is a little bit different because you created a video game called, yes, I did. Mm -hmm, called I Shall Remain. I Shall Remain, yes, I did. But there's something unique about this because there's been a lot of interest in vampires and zombies. Well, what's the inspiration by creating I Shall Remain? I Shall Remain is, uh, I'm, I'm obsessed with the whole zombie thing, and it's, it's a great, the whole, the whole zombie scene is a great community worldwide of people that's already there and are willing to take up new content. Um, everybody, there's a huge group of young people around the world who are coming together and making this whole culture of disaster preparedness and um, preparing for this this coming apocalypse. But it's it's great to jump on with them. They're a bunch of great people. I love creating content for them. Oh, you do? Absolutely. Uh -huh. Now, why zombies? Zombies, zombies are freaking awesome. <laughs> I mean, the zombie theme can can take so many avenues, can take so many avenues of approach with the storytelling. You put in redemption, you can put in fighting. You can put, there's so many, uh, so many um, parts of the human experience takes place in the zombie theme, and uh, it's a theme that's never going to go away. People are going to keep developing content. I'm, I'm very very excited to be on the. Uh, this, be the spear point right now and make a completely new one that's never been done before with U.S. Marines. Ooh, now I think, didn't you say there's a few Marines involved in the making yes. of this one? Yes, there was. Um, the first the first release was in memory of my friend, my good friend uh, Craig Hodges, who was a Marine who passed away in April 2010. Um, that's the main character you play as. And his rank is the, is, is a captain. And that Captain is the captain I I, uh, I served with when I was deployed overseas. His name is Captain Ackerman, and the combination of his rank and the last name put together is two very people, very important people in my life. It is. Oh. Absolutely. Now, did you take any inspiration, you know, from some of the places that you were traveling to as a Marine, in creating like the landscapes behind the no, zombie? I've never took any any uh, inspiration from places I've been. I've only taken um, inspiration from people I've met. Just the type, of, just the type of uh, a person you become as a Marine, and the type, and is, is the uh, that's what I try to create in the game. Yeah. Now, part of it is on killing those zombies. It's the zombies against whom again? The Marines? Yes. <laughs> You start. You start as the, you start out as a young marine, and you need to. In your, in your completely new situation, you don't know really who you are. You don't know what's around you. You just have to attack it and do the best you can to become a leader of men in the process. Ah, how many zombies do you have to kill before you're a leader of men? Oh, quite a few. There's a, there's a lot of gameplay coming up, so don't don't get uh, don't think you're gonna beat it right away. Now I noticed it's on. I noticed something about Linux. Yes, the, there was an incredible group of people online. The, the whole Linux community, they came together and brought my game's place rank from well over 200 to about 45 in about 6 hours. Yeah. And because of that, my next uh, my next platform the game will be released on will be on Linux. Um, they spoke out to us just by that and they said they wanted us to be part of their community. We're going to do it. We're going to make it public. What's it currently available on? It's only available on PC right now. Oh, it is. Yes. Uh. Next is Linux. After that, hopefully Mac. As long as fans keep coming, as long, long as our fans keep, you know, is, are that uh, the breath under our wings has been pushing us along so far, we're going to make it happen. Okay, so one of the things you always want to be, you know, it's like, are you going to do, like, team gameplay? Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Right now, we're, we're releasing in parts. We have a single player, and the revenue from that will help pay for the development of the multiplayer. And there's a lot of things we have. We're dreaming up. We're dreaming up of map editors. People can make their own content. This stuff never gets old. We're dreaming up of vehicles, all kinds of what. It's going to be great. And do you have a lot of different voices? Yes. Right now, most of them are being are uh, are done by Robert Burton, who's got, who did about three or four, no, five voices in the in the game. All of them completely unique. And it's great. This is it's somebody you can. Uh, Robert Burton's the type of guy you can give any task and knock it out. So, like with. I'm, he just blows me away, Robert. The, it's the voice we did for us. So, so many voices out of one person. Are completely different. So as a character, can you decide what kind of voice you want? No, not this time. Okay, that's we're, we're talking about future release. I know you're we're teasing them, aren't we? Yeah. <laughs> future release. Absolutely. <laughs> what were some of the biggest challenges in creating a game besides you know working being in the Marines at the same time? Um, of course, uh, being being active in Marine and uh, completing this project. The other, the other thing was. 
all of the development team are are, on, are in Romania right now. We have all kinds of great guys working for me. I got Eugene Udrea, Florian Udrea, Virgil, Olivia, all working for, for me full time um, out from Romania. And there's a time zone. There's a there's a language barrier. But we're able to pull it together. We're able to do it very very well and very very efficiently too. Yeah. Um, the amount of time we've taken to complete as much as we have, and the amount of the cost, people will be very impressed. What we've been able, what we've been able to accomplish with such, such little, such little resources. So, ideally, how can how can people show support for the game? Um, the best way they can you can uh, support us is by going over to desura.com, D-E-S-U-R-A.com, and checking out I Shall Remain, leading us up, downloading it, let us know what you think reaching out to us and, and being a part of our community. And Jake, is there anything you'd love to tell your fans out there? I absolutely love you guys. There's there's nothing better than than being able to be a part of all this. And and the only people who are responsible for this is, is you guys, is the fans who put, there again, was that breath under my wings who made all this possible. And Jake, the website again is? Desura.com, with the flash army. Thank you, Jake.